the check is in the mail for Nassau County residents still struggling to make ends meet due to the pandemic. Nearly half a million people eligible to receive funds through the Homeowner Assistance Program. Here to tell us more about it, Nassau County Executive Laura Curran. So, County Executive, good to see you. Welcome back. Hi, good morning. Happy Friday. Happy yes. Friday, indeed. My goodness, <laughs> CGIF. So, the Homeowner Assistance Program County Executive is making one time payments of $375 to so many Nassau County residents, right? So who is the first to actually receive it? How are you kind of organizing that? So the first to receive it are those who get Enhanced Star already, and those who live in Nassau County know what I'm talking about, mm -hmm. and also those who get exemptions, senior exemptions, limited income exemptions, and disability exemptions. Those folks will get the checks automatically. We're going to get them out by the end of the month. Uh, and then there's a couple of other categories as well, having to do with income and, and COVID impact. Okay, well, this grant obviously is meant to help low and middle income households, but there are different application requirements. So can you walk us through the requirement for a household making under $168,000? Sure, so those folks making under $168,900 uh, have to show proof of income. That's it, they show proof of income and then they will get the check. Now, folks making $500,000 or less between that 168.9K and 500,000, they have to show proof of income and they have also have to show impact from COVID. So it could be, a, it's a wide range of eligibility for COVID impact. It could be having to uh, prove that you missed a mortgage payment, a rent payment, that you have a medical payment that you couldn't make, COVID death payments. Uh, it could also be telecommuting equipment, increased mm -hmm. internet costs for distance learning. So, you know, any way that you've been impacted by COVID, you've got to show that. So, you know, many would say, well, for those making less than 168, the, it's, it's that one-time payment. For those making less than 500, it seems to be the same amount, right? So how come it wasn't more for those making less? So we wanted to make this as crisp and efficient as possible. We also have federal rules that we have to follow. This is money, it's $100 million that we got from the American Rescue Plan from the federal government. Our books are balanced in Nassau County, so now we wanna push this out to our residents, to our renters, to our homeowners. And I'm encouraging people when they get the check to use it in your local business, go to your local restaurants, keep it in the local economy so that our businesses can benefit from, from this as well. This is a way to stimulate the economy and to really have our recovery go gangbusters. Yeah, it's so important to support our local businesses. Now, yesterday was the first day that applications were being accepted. So how many applications have you received so far? So as you can imagine, uh, phones have been ringing off the yeah. hook. Mm -hmm. We actually have a website where people can go to. And next week, early next week, we're going to be opening in-person resource centers, three of them around the county where people can go and do this in person. But if you want me to give you the website, I will. People can go right now, get all of their questions answered and apply. That is nassaucountyny.gov slash HAP, H-A-P, for Household Assistance Program. And as I said, if you have a senior exemption, advanced star, disability exemption, limited income exemption, you're going to get it automatically. You yeah. don't have to do anything. Okay, oh, got okay. it. Um, and so, so let me ask you this then. Where is the money coming from? So as I said, it's from the American Rescue Plan money that we got in Nassau County. Uh, we got 200,000 of it this year. I wanna thank Senator Schumer for fighting hard for that. And we're gonna be getting more next year. So this is to help us recover from COVID. And as I said, our books are balanced in Nassau County. Our budget is in great shape. So how often is it that the government can actually right. give the money back to the folks who yeah. live here? So, so County Executive, is there a cap, right? Are you gonna run out at some point and say, okay, no more applications being accepted because we don't have any more money? So, uh, as you mentioned at the top, about 400,000 households are, are eligible. There is enough money for all of those households. Okay. So, you know, let's see how much we have. But it's that 100,000. When that's gone, it's gone. And quickly, is there a deadline, an application deadline? Well, this money can be used for years to come. I believe the deadline is 2026. So, uh, people have time to get this done. But don't put it off. Gotcha. All right. Thanks so much. Nassau County Executive Laura Kern, thanks for joining us this morning. And Nassau Thank County you. residents looking to fill out an application can head on over to pix11.com for a direct link to that site. Good information there. Yes.